Hey everybody, welcome to MT Guitar. Thanks for joining us today. If you're wondering, it's still the same MT. I just um, cut my hair, did a little self-cut. It's kind of what I do, I just grow it out and then buzz it. I've been doing that for 10 years. Not like anyone was asking. We're doing the Office theme song today, which is from the show The Office, the US version. One of my favorite shows, if not my favorite. And um, the opening theme song is very catchy, very famous. And it's performed on piano and accordion mainly, but there's also a full band that kicks in. So there's a lot going on with the song. And I arranged it for guitar a few years ago, kind of combining mostly the piano and the accordion part. It's a finger style tutorial. Uh, it's a lot of fun to do finger style, especially for solo guitar. So with that, let's get to work. Okay, so this is in the key of G. Bar chords are gonna be our best bet for the voicings that the piano is using. So we're gonna do third fret G chord. And so the right hand is thumb, uh, second and third finger all at once on the second, third, and sixth strings. Then first finger um, on the fourth string. And then back to second and third finger. And you do it one more time, second and third finger, and then first finger. That's that's the pattern. Okay. And then we do B minor, same exact thing except the thumb is on the fifth string. And then E minor, same pattern except the fingers move over. Uh, meaning the second and third finger now go to the first and second strings and the first finger is on the third string and the thumb is on the sixth string. See, so same pattern, it's just that we're on different strings. So. And then a C chord. And then we just hit hit the first, second, third string, and fifth string at once. And then you take over with the melody. First fret open, second fret, third string, second string open. Okay. And then we, we get to the main part here, the accordion part. Here's, here's, where, here's where it gets a little tough um, because we're going to combine the melody and accompaniment. So what I was doing is, I'll break it down note by note here. So I'm doing sixth string and third string at the same time. Sixth and third string. Now fourth string. And then a, a, a strum or a first finger down on all the strings basically to give it that full band feel because it is a kind of a rock song if you listen to it the full band is actually coming in there so ba -da -da. and then the melody goes up to third fret first string hit it with the sixth string at the same time third string and then strum see and then fifth and third string fourth string strum and then first string and fifth string together hammer on the third fret first string and then second and fifth string together second fret on the first string and then third fret second string so that's the melody and then E minor. So let's go over that. And then we land on the E minor, sixth and first string together. And then third string, and then strum. And then repeat. Meaning, after the strum, sixth and third string together, fourth string, and then strum. So. Okay. 
Now we get to this cool part where we can do some Travis picking. And so we'll do this um, C chord, and then we'll do fifth and second string together, and then fourth and second string, and then fifth and second string, and then first string open, and then second fret, third string, and fourth string together, and then second string open, so it's sixth and third string on the G chord. So let's do this all nice and slow. Okay, so then the second time, B minor is different. And because it's kind of difficult to do, you can kind of abandon the chord a little bit and just play the bass. So let's get there first. Here we go. So here's what we did. We did uh, fifth string, third string, strum, and then fifth and first string together like before. Hammer on third fret, but then hit fifth string and fifth fret first string. And then second fret first string, and then back to our E. So the E minor has this little melody that's not in the first phrase. So after we go, we go to the E minor like before, and it starts out the same with the sixth and first string, and then we go third string, and then strum, but then we hit third fret, second string, first string open, third fret, second string, second string open, and then into the C. So that's, The only thing I'm doing besides that melody is the sixth string for that third fret. And then I'm just focusing on the melody. So. Okay. And then the ending is a ninth fret, fourth string, seventh fret, third string, eighth fret, second string. And then. 7th fret, 3rd string, 8th fret, 2nd string, 7th fret, 1st string. Then 8th fret, 2nd string, 7th fret, 1st string, 10th fret, 1st string. And then 7th, 10th to 15. Slide up. So why don't we do the whole thing because it's kind of advanced at a slow pace, including the intro. Ready? So difficult but doable, and practice it slow, and um, enjoy. That's what's important. All right, well done. So practice this and uh, build up those finger style skills as much as you can. And subscribe to MT Guitar if you haven't already. Hit the notification bell and check in for the daily guitar lessons. Thank you so much to everyone who is subscribed and part of this channel. And other than that, have a great day, great rest of your weekend, and uh, see you next lesson. Bye.